Got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. Uh, the mother is back running her gums about <laughs> Rashawn and them business. Let's get it. Y'all know who I'm talking about. Da mama. So if you see that name, Pamela, that's his grandma. Sure. Oh, I don't know. I think they was already having feeling some type of way. But when Brock beat that ass, I don't know. I don't know. I think they was already having feeling some type of way before that. I think they was feeling some type of way back when when the jiggy stuff happened. I think back with the jiggy stuff is where her and blue went left. He used to draw tattoos on her. Girl, yeah, they were so tight. Like, you couldn't have told me that they wasn't gone. They took on the world together. They fought for them scholarships. They went door to door together begging for money because I couldn't afford that shit sometimes. They, they, <laughs> they fought hard together, honey. I hope they can at least one day get back to that because them two was thick as thieves. Oh, Kelly and Bluefus? It ain't happening. He don't like her. Pray they get back there when Blue get out of jail. Is Jiggy still in the picture? I don't, I haven't heard nothing about her, so I wouldn't know. You don't know nothing. I like Jiggy. She's always been respectful. I don't, I don't have nothing to say about her. Hopefully they can rekindle their relationship. Sibling relationships are important. I think Blue said his problem was with Callie was that she kept choosing Jaden's side over his side and she kept forgetting that that's what I heard him say out my own mouth. Yo, mouth. He tried to tell me that too, that we was choosing Jaden's side instead of his side and respecting what she wanted versus what what. Girl, yeah, because me and Callie was about to have to get Jiggy yeah, one day. So like, she, she, was going, she was bothering Jaden somewhere. This was like way at the beginning. Like, Jaden has sicked us on her. And then it was like, Oh, okay, that was y'all thing, huh? Jumping people. And then Krishan. That's why Krishan had to do what she had to okay, do. Okay, cool. And then I just, I tried to tell Blue Autumn. I was like, something about her. Something about her says she's using you. And he ain't believe me. And then when we got into it, that next month, she was like, yeah, I'm here for the money. And his poor heart just sunk. Like, he has to be, he has to be sitting there right now, y'all. Like, my mama tried to tell me. She tried to tell me. That girl, did y'all see his face when she was like, yeah, I'm here for the money. <laughs> I will say, I think Bluefist was in love with Krishan. A lot of y'all disagree, but at one point, he was real soft for her. Jaden was like, shh, trying to give her a hint. Like, shh, I said, ooh. And he was worried about me and Callie being there for the money. Yeah, nigga, we here for the money. Okay, <laughs> so fam. was she. So what's the problem? Money or not, he was there for the money too. Really? You goddamn right we here for the money. We put in on this. <laughs> how, many ball, how many balls, Callie? Now, he had to catch Callie rebounds. Y'all know how basketball go. Now, Callie had to run routes because this nigga's a quarterback. Yes, nigga, we here for the bag. We not fixing to pretend. <laughs> but her, on the other hand, <laughs> child, he was so hurt. I could see it on his face. He was hurt. I'm glad you and Jaden in a good place. Yeah, you know, and even if we not in a good place, as long as we in a good place enough to respect that the kids, you know what I'm saying? Respect the kids' wishes. Cause I don't, yeah, now y'all know I don't put the makeup artist at all. I don't like her. I probably never will like her, but what I love her kids. So when Carter say, I want to see my friend, I'm just, I just called a bit like, can you drop them off? You ain't got to come in and talk. We ain't got to kick it. But I'm not fixing to let Carter's feelings be hurt about his friends because I don't like a grown-up. You know? I never thought that Carlissa would, like, harm Junior. I just feel as though 
she would be over there making mockeries of him, though. Um, little things that he does, and she would make videos out of it for real. And that's just not genuine. But do I think she would physically harm him? I don't. You know what I'm saying? Like that just doesn't make I sense still to me. Wouldn't let her have my child. So you know, hey, to each their own. Though, if y'all use kids for bait, I get it. I never use my kids a day in their life away from the other side, grandparents, cousins. Hell, stepmama. Callie's stepmama that I couldn't stand her whole life was at her 18th birthday party, and I had to sit there and look at her. I wasn't finna be like, I'm not coming. You invited her, I'm not coming. You know what I'm saying? I just ain't never had no hate in my heart like that. You can't, you can't make me hate you like that. At some point, we gotta be adults. That's the hard part about being an adult, y'all. If you out here and you young, the hardest part that we gotta deal with is being the adult. Mm, it's a hard thing to do. My, now, my husband right now, even though I punched his baby mama in her head, I call her and apologize for his kids. You know what I'm saying? Because I know you can't be kicking it with somebody's kids and then be having vengeance towards their mama. So I called Lady Mama and I told her, I'm sorry, ma'am. I was drunk and you was whispering in my husband's ear. So, you know what I'm saying? I had to gain my respect and my composure. That's just what it was. Yeah, I don't, I don't got nobody that I hate. Not nobody. Yeah, Carlos got a new house a minute ago. The girl that was in a relationship with Blue and Jaden, yeah, they, it was a quick relationship. <laughs> Try to tell him. You had in this broad all the damn money and we trying to spend the money. How you gonna give it to this weirdo? And that's why he had to cut them off. Why does your son have to give you money to the point where he can't get the other girl money? That would have got on my nerve. I already got to deal with my shorty and, and, and you know, my baby mama and all that. Now, and I got to deal with y'all. Man, you don't get the hell. You can't tell these ninjas nothing, honey. Yeah, she didn't want the dog around. Like, she played herself. Why would Jaden put Blue on child support? They are a team. John is never going to let Jaden go without. Even if John got married to Megan Thee Stallion, it would have to be understood that he's not going to let Jaden go without. He's just not going to do it. He saw how hard we had it and how good his dad just left and had it. He would never do that. I would never agree to that. Did they get blue chain back from who? What happened with the chain? I don't know nothing about it. I got the one he gave me. Is you talking about the one he gave me? I got mine. So what will be the point of child support? Um, I get like I gave Jonathan daddy the option to come do what you got to do for your son and you don't have to give me nothing. Just come, you know, make sure he got what he need every Friday. Just come check in with him. He'll tell you what he need. I mean, if you can't do at least do that, then you did. You need to pay something. You just think it's okay to just leave your kids and don't do nothing for them. Yeah, you you the type of person that should be on child support. It was supposed to have for snatched the other night from Jaden while on baddies. I just couldn't see that happening with all them security guards that Lemmy got and Bodine being there. So I, I'm going to have to decline on that one. I, I haven't heard anything about it. They said someone in Milwaukee snatched one of Blue's chains off Jaden when she was performing. Not sure if it was true or not, though. No, Jaden got robbed for his chain on baddies. 
but you said he wouldn't do that. So why is y'all lying about the chain? <laughs> y'all lying again about the chain. That's probably somebody that know Jaden in there talking about y'all lying about the chain. How would you oh my bad. If you moved, I was saying that. Um. Well, first of all, they go to link for the glasses right there. Oh, you got it. And um, I said, y'all know Bluefoot would have been in uh, prison, child. Somebody tried to snatch his chain and snatch Jaden's, his chain off Jaden's, please. On And your mom publicly always tampered with your new relationship because she like your last man. Um, Publicly tamper with your relationship. If you kick me in my face, I'm going to publicly talk shit. Probably for the rest of my life. <laughs> so if you talking about me, <laughs> there you have it. I'm probably going to talk shit for the rest of my life. I don't think that you should ever put your hands or your mouth in a disrespectful manner to a man that you love and his mama. No. I was always taught. That's a lie. When I became an adult, I was taught. I understand that you respect your elders and as you should. But tell them, don't forget I'm an adult. Girl, don't ever, and I mean ever, think you're going to talk to me as crazy as you, as Carlissa talk, and think I'm going to put them paws on you, baby. You're going to get, yeah, you're going to have to see me. Yay. You're going to have to see me in real life. Because what are we talking about? I don't want her dog here. She this and she that. Please. Better leave me alone. Now, I wouldn't have went around her no more, because I'm not about to just be hitting on people mamas either. I'm not. But... Don't keep, I, I wouldn't, I wouldn't have never went around her again. I just, it ain't, it ain't, it's not giving. Don't ever do that. I don't care what these weird ass people on this internet. If your man's mama start cussing you out, walk away, go get in your car, drive off. That's okay. And don't get me wrong. No yes. That is the responsible thing to do to leave. But what people don't understand is everybody just ain't that damn responsible. You get what I'm saying? Everybody has not, uh, matured yet you know what i'm saying i have matured because i don't like jail all i needed was a little taste of jail to understand what jail really was and to know that i don't like it <laughs> you know what i'm saying so a lot of times i'm not doing a lot of things because i ain't going to jail i ain't going to jail at all actually for nobody but um it's no way that I would have been there and you're going to keep talking to me like that. That's just crazy. Somebody to start talking crazy. If somebody started talking crazy to my mama, we would not be not cleaning up your shit, your dog. Shit. And, and, and this house is nasty and she ain't doing it. That's what it is. She ain't doing it. They tried to get me to do something that I said I wasn't doing. And I had to argue and stand my ground and the shit turned into some kids being disrespectful to an adult and I don't know how to handle that. If Carter's friend coming here right now talking shit, he probably going to get laid out. <laughs> okay. So if your kids come over here and they get smart with me, just know they going to get laid out. Don't even tell them. To, if you got the type of kids that you allow to disrespect adults, I'm from the seventies. If you got them kind of kids, they can't come over here. Just know they going to get laid out. Do you think Jaden has ever asked me, did you have to lay John, Javon out? You think I ever called her and told her I laid Javon out? No, ma'am. I'm not telling them shit. They my kids. And if they get jiggy, they going to get what laid out. What about it? It just dropped? Now, if you don't like it, don't oh, send them over ATL, here. Yeah. That's why the recent videos now show she's not wearing any jewelry no more. I don't think they're supposed to be wearing jewelry on there as far as I knew. Jaden didn't get no chain snatched off her. That looked like her friend, so there y'all have it. And I'm pretty sure she'll pop out with it on to let y'all know. As soon as she hear y'all talking shit. <laughs> What you think about Sadie and Jaden not being friends anymore? I didn't know they wasn't friends no more. I didn't know they wasn't friends no more. 
Jaden only got like maybe one or two friends that I think is worth saying they her friends. Sadie would be one of them. The one girl that had used to have a real cute shape, she should have kept her. <laughs> I told her that. What was that one girl she had at the very beginning? She should have kept her. Mm -hmm. um, I think she was a tourist too. Who her friend was, y'all, back in the back when she was back before all of this started happening. Cause I could see her, you know, when Jaden friends come around my son, I could see how they move to where it's about him or about her. Like, you know, that's just things that moms do, you know? Like I could see how people moving when you bring them around me. I could, all I need is three or four days. I could tell you if that's going to be good for you or bad for you. You could ask me, I'm going to tell you, you could listen or Shit, you could that's not That's all listen. I need now. But your mama is supposed to be able to look into the into the eyes of that soul and tell that child, mm -mm, no, ma'am, or yes, ma'am. That that should that should be all right. And I told Jaden that one girl was good for her, but she them other girls see the girls get catty with Jaden. They want to argue and fight over her because they want to be the main girl. But that girl never ever ever. I never seen her like do too much in front of my son, switch in front of my son, twerk in front of my son. I never seen her do too much. Do y'all ever pay attention to that when y'all around y'all friends to see if they uh trying to push up on y'all man? Y'all ever do that? Cuz you know, people will push up on your partner, girl, right in front of you. Like Nick Mama situation, bro. That's some disrespectful ass right there. Like, I've known you for 18 years, been with you for 18 years, been friends with her for 13. So, ain't no telling how long, oh my God. I would have gone crazy thinking about everything that happened in front of me. Let alone what's behind me. But what you do in front of me. Oh, in the same house. Like, what makes you so thirsty like that? That's so disrespectful, bro. And don't get me wrong. We all have our thirsty ways now. I ain't saying, you know, niggas perfect. But I am saying I ain't out here 40, you know, even in my 30s. But 45, 50. She probably 50. 50, because Neek 27, she got to be 50. 50, looking at your friend. Man. I would have, I would have said, can we do a three-way? You know, if it just, if I just had got to get it up off me. You know what I'm saying? I'm speaking for her because I don't do three ways. Don't want no three way. Never did a three way. Too much going on. Don't want it. Uh-uh. But I'm just saying, like, in her house. Ugh. I will always, when Jaden not looking, you know how bitches, they, hey, you know, they doing a little extra stuff in front of your man when you ain't looking, going in a room with him, talking to him, doing extra. That's the whole you got to watch. Now, if the man don't phase her and it's just all, you could tell if it's all about the female. I Messed only up the seen whole family maybe one. For her? The girl she got now. Um, Why is that worth it then? You messed up the entire family dynamic, 18 years of it, for her when it's a million women on this earth? Other one, Quincy's cool. Um, I think she's cool. I don't think she's there. I guarantee it was the woman fault, the feminine one. Guarantee. There for blue. She's always had her own man and her own motion. And that one girl, that one girl I think was cool for her, but they fell out. But that was her good friend. I, and she got one good friend from high school that don't be kind of in none of this. She stay out the way, but that's her good friend from high school. And I think Quincy is her good friend because Quincy was like, <laughs> Quincy was going to help Jaden get me, honey. <laughs> Quincy was about it. I don't really know too much about Sadie um, at all. I just know that that's Bravo's girl and John and Bravo is close. So I couldn't oh, see her not being okay. So I don't. Yeah. 
But girl, yeah, you, you it's only been a couple of them that I know. Like this Jaden done have some friends that girl that will bend over right in front of John, honey. And show them all her chicken grease, honey. Yeah. She will girl, Jaden done have great. some friends. She usually good at detecting it too. Jaden is usually good at detecting it. But with the one girl, I never seen no like no flaws in her. I can't remember what her name was, but I did like that one girl for Jaden. The one that had the real cute little bitty waist and the real big booty. Who would tell me who she is? I forgot that quick. She was a good girl. And when you around baddies, it ain't you can't you can't help it. It, it is what it is. But you can control, she can control what the hell she doing, especially. That's why niggas don't be around. Like anybody got time for that, bro. Is Drake, girl, Drake, Drake is, lives in the DR now. Drake don't even live here no more. We ain't got to worry about Drake. He down there somewhere with Johnny's daddy. <laughs> you know Johnny's daddy? That mother couldn't wait to retire. He took all his money down here with them big booties. <laughs> girl, he down there speaking that flick it, flick it, flick it, shit. He down there with him. Uh, he went and got him a couple hot tamales <laughs> and sat his ass down. Hot tamales is crazy. But Jaden likes girls too, right? I think she would probably, she probably was going through her phase. I think that's, I think that's. Um, Jaden wasn't in no phase. She I loved think she might have went through her phase. I never seen her like. Try to hit on no girl, so I never seen her like move like that. So that Jayden surprised like me, but can you do Journey's hair more often? I like Journey's hair naturally nice and curly in her afro. She just reeks African princess. They need to stop. She don't need no ponytails. She don't need no braids. She just need to let her curls flow. <laughs> so if if she was with me all the time, that's how I would have her hair. So y'all would be mad at me because I would put a cute little bow and some conditioner and just let it go. Because it's so cute with just the curls. All of that, pulling it and stressing it and the braids and all of that. Now, Avery mama, my other grandbaby mama do hair. So that's why Avery hair down to her butt already. Because Katie know how to do hair. She know about all the products. So she keep that baby Don't be hair knowing snatched, nothing. Just okay? be chatting. Katie know how to do that baby hair better than me, honey. That white woman know how to do Avery hair, honey. <laughs> All right, y'all. We're going to get up off here because, y'all, she going to keep talking about the same thing. Um, I think she done got the tea off her chest. Let's hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on one more thing. Them my two lover babies. It's okay. age because I, I was about to miss all that. Grandma okay. and your aunties. Cause, <laughs> cause I don't think Jaden gonna be able to handle her. Okay, handle you who? Grandma, honey, she got she got her attitude set up, honey. I'm gonna have to pull up for Jaden. I'm gonna say about eight nine. I'm gonna have to pull up. She gonna have to be like, I'm about to call your grandma and your aunties. Cause, <laughs> oh, she ain't gonna be able to handle Journey. Cause I don't think Jaden gonna be able to handle her. And you already know John's going to be a old simp. It's okay. Leave her alone. Definitely going to be doing that. Yeah, me and Callie going to have to pull up for Jaden because Journey is gangster. Okay? She thick-handed. She long. She about to be like, she about to look like my stepdaughter. I'm not lying. Journey's about to be a six-footer, y'all. Journey is going to be beating women up. All little girls up on the playground. Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. <clears throat> I'm done with this video. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hell yeah.